just here. If you want to know where all them aliens are living, come down here. Oh, <laughs> baby. It's an old new world. Just shut that. How you doing, son? All right? Oh, yeah. Same to you. Same to you, son. So there's a little... I've not I've not explored around here. They're in bed doing... Ah, waking them up. We've got ourselves some goodies. We've got ourselves some goodies. Okay, okay. I'm liking that. I didn't... Greetings, greetings, greetings. How are you all today? Good I hope. Right, welcome to a new Let's Play on the channel. I know what you're saying, Tis Kate. Another one. Yep. Yeah. Well, bit of a backstory before we start, shall we? I played a, a map by these people, I'm going to tell you all about in a second, called Raft. Absolutely awesome map. Absolutely loved it. A load of you loved it as well. It, it did really, really well on the channel. Anyway, a couple of days ago, I tweeted them. This is uh, G2 Crafted and says to them, the Father and Son team, uh, any chance of updating Raft? And they sent me back saying, Cheesecake, we're working on Raft 2. But on Tuesday, this is Tuesday just gone, so I'm recording, we will be releasing another map. And I think you'll like it. So I uh, I sat waiting till 6 o'clock on Tuesday till it updated. Clicked on it. Boom. And we got ourselves Project Moonscape. And I tell you what, I'm not disappointed because I've had a sneak peek around in Creative. Just have a look at a few things. And I tell you what, it's absolutely awesome. So it's called Project Moonscape. I'll read what it says. It's by G2 Crafted, the Farmers on Team. Oh, they made that raft map. It was absolutely awesome. And like I said, they're making raft too. So uh, <laughs> I can't wait for that. But anyway, we've got this. So it says... The people of Earth have sent you to the moon in hopes of building a new world for all of humanity. You have been given some specific tools to help along the way. Uh, lucky, or lucky for you, you're not alone. The local, which you probably can hear, the local inhabitants are happy to trade with you. It says uh, from the creators of Raft, which I know, uh, it says a one-of-a-kind tools. There's a net blaster, which... The net blaster is really, really awesome, but it's, uh, well, I'll tell you in a second. There's a net blaster, there's an earth converter, and there's an enchanted ore sieve. There's some of the things, that if you if you watch my raft series, there'll be an eye up in the corner somewhere up there. Click on that and watch it. They've got some of the um, equipment that they're adding that in this one as well, and some added extras. One of them puts a bit of spanner in the old cheesecake works. You'll see why in a second. Uh, yeah, and you also get free skins. It's 490 coins. Always reasonable. Go get to them. They're always reasonable. And they always make a really good map. At the time recording, it's got, I think it's a 4.9 on the rating bar. Looks of it. Can't really see. Yeah, 4.9 on the rating bar. Looks of it. Right. So, oh, by the way, if you do enjoy this video, don't forget to leave a like. I really appreciate it. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. We've also got a Discord channel. So, if you want to know about any maps or that I play or you want help with anything or anything else or you want to know what these, uh, can you hear them voices? <laughs> You want, you want someone to interpretate what they're saying. You know what I mean? Jump in there, say hi. People will help you out if you're stuck on a map or something that I've showcased or play, or just jump in there, say hi, and I'll say hi back. So, we've spawned just here. I'm really, really excited because I know what's coming, and if you've not seen it before, oh, you're going to love this. So, we've got a chest. We've got to uh, insert uh, the information drive in there, but we'll do that in a bit. Uh, we'll have a quick look. So, in here, we've got this. Now, this is a fishing rod, right? Now, if you, if you watch me play um, Raft, you'll know that halfway through Raft, I made myself an auto fisher. This, this thing here has stopped me from doing that, I do believe. I might see if I can work around it, but I do believe it stopped me from doing that. But we'll have a look at that in a second. We've got an ore sieve, which is, this is a new item, this. I've not seen this before. Uh, a stone hoe, some bread, some bees, a beehive, a couple of trees. Because obviously, the idea is we've spent to the moon, Earth's done for, we're going to get ourselves... Some grass. We're gonna we're gonna make it livable so everybody can come up here and join me. Nice you. I prefer to stay on my own. We've also got a book, so we'll have a quick look at this because it's gonna. I suppose there'll be some help in here. It says, "Welcome to uh, Project Moonscape. This is your guide. It will help you uh, guide you through the trials of this map." Right. Okay. Let's see. Use your earth converter tool to change moon dust into dirt. This will help the grass to grow and stop the mods from spawning. Use your net launcher to collect uh, supplies from the emerald water pools, which are awesome. And let me say something, there's some awesome stuff in that as well. I'm proper, proper well excited, I am. Uh, use your crucible. We know about crucible before, don't we? Fill it with cobblestone to create lava. Use your water bucket to call the lava in the crucible to bet obsidian. Sieve the dirt, sand. We know about that. Okay, use your glowing ore sieve. Now, this is a new thing, the glowing ore sieve. To increase your ore output from the emerald pool. 
Okay, so I'm gonna have to look into that. Uh, fill your mulch or uh, two moon dirt to receive grass block. Uh, what else have we got? Place uh, type. Of, uh, yeah, okay, okay, okay. So there's a book in there. You, you, you can pause the video and read that if you want to. We've got this in it. Let's let's go outside. Right, we'll, we'll have a look at that in a second. Let's go outside and meet the locals. Right, they're a chatty bunch. We've got to be careful because there is some bad stuff. So these. <laughs> Awesome, awesome texture, awesome, and you can trade with these. You click on them, and you can trade. This, this is nothing. This is just a tiny bit of what I found in this world, which is absolutely awesome. So you can trade with these, cause here, there's like uh, the spaceship I come down to. Is the um, right? The sun's the sun's there. Where's? Wait till you see the Earth. Wait till you see the Earth. So this, I should imagine, is the Emerald Pool. If you have a look in the Emerald Pool down here, we've got some emeralds there. There's some strange looking fish in there. You can go in. Seems to be uh seems to be alright, but just just have a look at these. Look at them. Creepy looking, weird alien. They probably, <laughs> probably have a good chat, these are. So if I let me go uh, let me show you, right? So we've seen this before, we've seen the mulchers and the sieves. So if I was to break a bit of this, just for people who don't know, but uh, if I do a bit of this and go in here, I can drop this on air bet and it can just sieve it through. Oh. Cheesecake, cheesecake broke it because he's a moron. Let's put that back down. Let's put, I'm supposed to click on that. Right, let's drop that on there. Do that, that. And we've got ourselves some bits and bobs. Obviously, that's the mulch jar. Then we've got the crucible and the uh, grinder for the cobblestone and that. Okay. We'll, we'll get into that later on. But for now, you want to see... All right. <laughs> you want to see... That. That is a game changer. Look at that. Awesome. That's just awesome. Just beyond awesome. So we've got this. Uh, we've got this thing over here. This is, I suppose, what we landed here on. Okay, I've not really had a look inside in that, but we will do. But in this world, you want to have a look around because obviously the emeralds and bits of bobs. You have a look around down little holes and little things because I was having a look round. Oh, gotta be careful. Cause then, like the like alien endermen. Oh, by the way, because we're on the moon, we can bounce around. You know what I mean? <laughs> we can proper bounce around, which is awesome. If we go, I want to show you. Let me just show you a couple of things. And then we can get into it. This is a massive emerald pool. I didn't see this last time. That's a massive one, that is. I'll show you the fishing net in a second. And I'll explain to you why. Because you know Cheesecake and his auto fishes. I don't think it's going to work with this fishing net. So we've got a little towel there. Just look at that. That is just, it's so, so good. So, so good. Right, I have to try to remember. All right, son. Try to remember where I found. There's so much hid on there. I'm not going to show you all in this one. Oh, don't look at the end. I looked at him. Yeah, I'm going back to the respawn screen. They hit like an absolute steam train, they do. Oh, he's still chasing me. I ain't going to get in here before he gets me. Wow. Wow. <sighs> Let me take this out for a second. Let me show you this. Oh, we'll have to have a look at that. We'll, we'll investigate that. We'll got plenty of time. We're not going to rush away through this. Is he still out there? Ah, he is. He's still, he's still out there, isn't he? I don't think. I think. I think I can get. Hmm, I think he's. We're trapped. I don't think he can get in here. I think he's too tall. Where is he? Don't look at him. Don't look at him. Is he? Yeah, I think he's left us. I think, I think we're all right. I want to show you. I'm going to die. Is he going to leave us alone? Right, let me show you. Where was it? It was just here. If you want to know where all them aliens are living, come down here. Oh, <laughs> baby. It's an old new world. Just shut that. Hey, doing, son? All right? Oh, yeah. Same to you. Same to you, son. So there's a little... I've not, I've not explored around here. They're in bed. They're in... Ah, waking them up. We've got ourselves some goodies. We've got ourselves some goodies. Okay, okay. I'm liking that. I think. Is that a baby cat? Okay. So we've got these little rooms off, rooms off. Okay, so the blast furnace. This isn't. You see, I only looked at the door and I thought, I don't want to spoil it. Then I'm going to go inside. a wandering tradesman there. Hey, did he come up in the spaceship with me? So they've got some. Some cows, some sheep. Just. It's just such a good map. It's just done so good. 
Okie dokie, so we've got flowers. They're already, they're already sorted out with little kit here. They've already sorted stuff out here. So we've got different kinds of trees and everything if you want to come in here. And different kind of flowers. I never stop chatting these. They're all friendly, you know what I mean? I landed here. There was no probing going on. <laughs> so she said, come with us. Let's put you in a test test centre. And Whoa, I might be in here in a second. So let's have a quick look what we've got in here. Another music disc. Which is what the other thing is, another music disc. Uh, some lands and some buckets. That's coming out. All right, son. Where did he come from? No probing going on in here, son. I'm out of here. Uh, oh, there's another little door here. Okay, this is like a computer. It's warning tradesmen's in here. Oh, it's just... Just... And this is this is just tiny little bits that I've found. There's just so much more. I'm loving this. I never realised this was so big. What you uh, What are you trading, by the way? Paper for trade. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Whatever you said, son. So the one in tradesman there. But this, this is where they all live. This is just beautiful. Just beautiful. I mean, there's grass blocks in here. I suppose we can move the grass blocks outside and use it to spread, but I don't want to, I don't want to ruin it. I just don't want to, you know, it's just, it's just so good. Let's uh, let's go back outside. Hopefully there's no um, Enderman. So obviously we're going to need to get ourselves an iron pickaxe, which there is some iron in there. Well, let me shut the door, so... Because there's plenty of emeralds knocking around. Now, I don't know how deep the world is. I don't know if there's any diamonds in here. I don't know anything else. I literally found that and thought, I won't go inside. I'll wait till I'm recording. So, we'll have a... We'll have a wander off. Where's the... Um... I think that is just done. That's just... Blows my mind. Blows my mind. So, let's just have a wander around. See if there's anything else around the edges. There's plenty of moon pools. Oh, let me show you. So this here is classed as like a little, little, little fishing rod. Watch this. Right, and then you'll understand. So do this like that. Look how big that is. What's that say to you? And then you click it, obviously. That stopped me auto fishing because it's too big. That looks like it's a full block. I don't know if it, it might work because last time, whoa, there is loads of them. Loads of them things across there. Let's just go over in this direction. So it may might still work. I might still be able to creep in an auto fisher, but that is an awesome, awesome tool. Nicely done. Nicely done. So right, what else have we got? I need to start digging around, start getting some grass. I mean, we, we've got to make it inhabitable for uh, all the rest of the population to come up here and ruin. You know what I mean? The ruin Earth, send cheesecake up here on his own. You know what I mean? We'll, we'll have a decent fishing rod and that, but uh, I could have been probed in anything. Ooh, there's, is there something? Like, oh, whoa, 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 let's not, uh, okay, there's, there's something there, I don't want to look to, so okay, so there's plenty of stuff to go and find, whoa, okay, is that, right, so there's some, like, that looks like, is that like an andesite, or doramite, some more emeralds, let's just, um, let's have a quick look over, before we start, uh, getting into the tools, we, we need to know what's going on in this country, uh, on this country, on this, uh, on the moon, we need to know what we're working with. You know what I mean? Is it worth staying here, to be honest with you? Should we go to Mars? Whoa, my word. Oh, my word. I would absolutely get battered there. Right, so there's emeralds. Okay, so there's, we know there's some kind of monument thing behind us. Around the edge. And just... There's a couple of big moon pools, which is good. Love. Love the Earth. I miss the Earth. I bet Molly... I bet Molly's up there now waiting for me. Jeez, Kate, you're supposed to be rescuing me. <laughs> I'm not rescuing her. I've left. I'm on the moon, son. Living it. Living the dream. Oh, not liking the Enderman, though. It seems like they're just like... Well, I don't, I don't suppose it's called Enderman up here. What could it be called? That's it. Uh, so there is, is the caves and emeralds. Yeah, so it looks like there is caves and stuff. Hmm. There's, there's, oh, you see, there's plenty of emeralds. Which is really, really good. Really good. And that, I have to find out what that, um, that sieve thing does. That's just, uh, going all the way around the edge. Emeralds. So there is, there is caves to explore. Okay, we've not found anything else yet. What, oh, there's, what's, is that, is that our base back up there? It looks like it, yeah, it is. Okay, so we know what we're going to do. We've got to get some grass because that's going to stop the mob spawning. Let's think about it. Get some grass. Do some sieving. We know we've, we know where some iron is. 
so we can make an iron pickaxe, get the emeralds. We've got an ore sieve, which helps with the, uh, what did it say, with the um, thing. Obviously, I'll go back and read the book. And we know the moon pool. And we also get stuff from the moon pool. Oh, yeah, there's another thing here. Okay. I'm loving this. I'm loving it. It's got everything. It's got everything. There's stuff to do, stuff to work out. I'd love to know what's in there. Well, uh, well no rush. So you can jump two blocks high. Okay, oh, let's see to, let's see to bear this. The sun's coming up. So that's getting a bit warm. It's a bit cold at night on the old moon. Another big moon pool there. Okay, okay. Right, so there's, there's a few things we can go looking for. Is this like plenty of emeralds? So we know where our biggest thing, food. Food's definitely going to be the... Wow, there's so many different kinds of aliens. And they all are running around this moon pool. Let's, uh, let's do a bit of this. Oh, they do damage. Oh, that's on his head. <laughs> oh, then. Right, okay. Let's see what we get. Let's just have a few few minutes fishing. It's like it's like being back on the fishing lodge. I <sighs> love that fishing lodge. If you've not watched that, fishing island. I've been taking a bit of a vague. Oh, bit of dirt. I'm I'm thinking that's a block wide. Would it work with an AFK fish? I know I know it's cheating. I know it's cheating, but I did it in uh, what's the name? In raft, and it helped me out a lot. To be honest with you. Just want to see. Oh, too soon then. I tell you what, the chat here. And there's cats on here as well. Okay, so that's uh, Doramite. So there is Doramite. That's white stuff is Doramite. We can put that in the um, what's the name, can't we? Yeah. Okay, so we're catching dirt. So realistically, the, mm, so we've got dirt. What we've got there? Granite. Okay. What an awesome bit of, awesome bit of stuff. The fish are absolutely special. Creeper. Absolutely creep me out the fish, dude. And we've got some saplings as well. And I, I think this is going to be in raft too. I'm thinking, from what I've seen... Oh, slide block slow down a bit. I think this is going to be in raft too, which... Uh, you know what I mean? I'm looking forward to that, but uh, we've got... We've got uh, no point mushing. We've, we've got to sort ourselves out. Start making it green around that area. Around where we are there. To stop the um, enderman or whatever they're called spawning at night. Can we get into this? It looks like it should be able to. Without destroying it. So there's some kind of computer here. Oh, let me take that out of my hand. <laughs> Food's going to be one of the uh, one of the things. Yeah, it looks like we should should be able to get into that, I reckon. There's, defi ooh, there's definitely something. We might have to. Um, I'll tell you what. Let's bridge up. Let's see if we can have a look through the window. Yeah, food. I don't know what the aliens are eating. If they're eating them fish, I'm not eating them. I'm not eating anything that's only got one. Yeah, it's, do you see the state of it? For one, it lives in a green pool. And for two, it didn't, it didn't look that tasty to me. Right, okay. I'm thinking. Let's, um, let's. I wonder if you could. I bet you don't take full damage. Or do you take full damage? Okay, can we, uh. So it's not like. It's not like sand. What's in there then? Oh, there's another. One. Oh, see that might be worth a look. Now we need to test. Do you take full damage? No. Hoo -hoo, of course you don't, because you're on the moon. Of course you don't. You're on the moon, but you have to test it, don't you? You have to test these things. It's no good being down to two arts and thinking, can I jump off here, and then realising you do. Right. So. We need to start getting ourselves some grass down. I need to sort out some food. And I need... There's so much I need to do. There's so... What is... Uh, we, do you put... I can't remember how, I can't remember how this thing works. Ah, oh, that's it. Chuck there in there. That makes the old cobble, don't it? Yes. I remember it now. And then we put the uh, thing in the sieve. If you put the dirt in here... Is it dirt in here? Oh, no, no. I think it's... I think it's two of these... You put two of these in here like this. Is it? Is it these? Yeah, it is. And that should compost down and give me a grass block. And then we've obviously got a sieve. Now, we've also got that special sieve in there for the ores. Does that give us a grass block? 
Oh, why do I keep breaking things? Cheesecake, you're a moron. Let's just, uh, I'm sure that gives us a grass block. I'm thinking, look at it. Oh, cheesecake, look, look. <laughs> it's only been here two minutes. It's all destroyed the place. Look at them, they're well, they're well interested, aren't they? All right, how we doing? All right, are you all right? Yeah, you're all right. It's, everybody seems all right. So what's this stuff here, then? This stuff is... This stuff is... This is sand. Okay. Boom. Yes, it does. Can you put sand in here, then? No. So you can put this stuff in here, which is... Is this like moon rock or something? Let's just uh, break some out. I forgot what it's called. This is called... Uh, coarse dirt. But it's like moon. And this will give us grass. Boom. Okay. And then we can put the grass... And we can put the dirt down. So that'll start to... Uh, I bet they're thinking, whoa, what are you doing, son? We like, we like it. We like the old uh, moon dirt. Probably having a good laugh, though, isn't it? Right, so we know about that. We know about that. So this, this, that gives us the cobble. So for one Doramite, it is Doramite, or is that Andesite? Doramite, yeah. You're getting two. That's not a bad. And then the crucible, you put, yeah, I can't remember, put the lava in, don't you? But it's, it, yeah, I have to read the book. I have to read the book here. Let's go back inside here. So then there's this thing here. The ore sieve. What did it say about the ore sieve? It says... Duh, 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 duh. Use the net to collect... Um, fill the mulch jar with two moon, yeah. Moon dirt. We've done that. Grass blocks. Sieve dirt and sand, yeah. Sieve gravel. Use the glowing ore sieve to increase your ore output. From the emerald pool. Use the glowing ore sieve to increase your ore out. So does that mean you can get ores out the... Does that mean you can get ores out the uh, finger? Oh, let's just do that. Let's... Well, I'll see a second. Why, why it's daytime, it's not too bad. Let's go in here. Whoa, look, oh, of course, fish then. Did you, did you see them? They're massive. They are proper... Let's have a... Let's see... Okay, so we're getting tree. Are we getting are we getting little nuggets? I bet we get nuggets. Okay, there we go, there we go. We've got some more. Okay, yeah. Right, let's just Whoa, do you see that? They're proper. Just just What? I mean I suppose we are on are on the moon, you know what I mean? They are proper weird things. So now we've got some more. Yeah. Like so. What I'm thinking is does it... I shouldn't imagine it needs to be smelting. Let's do that. We'll keep this in here because, you know what I mean? I don't know what these aliens are like. They might, they might decide to, you know what I mean? Help themselves to my... Uh, so if we drop the ore in the sieve here... What do we get? Did we get anything? Right, so we've got two. But we put two in there. You can't put ingots in, can you? It's just to... Okay. Unless you don't get it all the time. So that's just for the ores. Okay, right. What else did we have in here? We had a... Um... Oh, we've got some bread here. That's a... You can't beat it, eh? Come all this way. What is it? Two million miles or whatever it is. And you get a bit of bread. Lovely stuff. Lovely stuff. Right. I think for the first episode, we'll call it. So uh, thank you very much for watching. Project Moonscape. Has arrived. Has landed, should I say. It's a small leap for uh, mankind. Massive leap for cheesecakes, to be honest with you. Oh, big leap. Thank you very much for watching. If you do enjoy it, remember to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel. We just clicked on this video. Hello to you new subscribers. Hello to you old subscribers. If you were watching uh, G2 Crafted, Father and Son, awesome. Yet again, awesome. 10 out of 10 for your map. Absolutely love it. 490 coins. Worth every, every penny. Absolutely awesome. You take care of a wonderful day. Memo, if you know anything about the map, or you can help me out. I mean, it's only been out a couple of days, but if you can help the old cheesecake out, jump in the Discord, say, Cheesecake, do this, you noob. If you forgot about this, or if you go here, you can do this, because me, I need all the help I can get. You take care of a wonderful day, and I'll see you next one of uh, Project Moonscape, which won't be long, because I am so excited to play it. It's ridiculous. See you later. Bye. Right, I think I'll uh, go outside, have a chat with these locals. See if, see if I can pick up a bit of the language tomorrow. So I'll, oh, I'll go out the door first. <laughs>